Yeah. Now people get it, especially after that show that they did, which I thought that was really good, even though they kind of went really left as far as like the the story was not anything from the comic book. They just kind of took the world of that and did whatever they wanted to do. But I like the story that they told within it. And it's the reason why they bring it back for a second season, because they were oh, talking yeah. about all that, of- that real shit that happened to us and they don't like that not just the real shit but that the very ending when she got ready to step out on that water they was like oh no 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 it won't be one of y'all we will not paint that picture <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> not yep. paint that picture. and it's funny because a white dude was the one that put the whole shit in motion as far as like wanting to do the show he just that was the story that they chose to do which was very powerful Yes. Like I really like that they used that, and then notice the other show, which was excellent. That Lovecraft Country joint also had themes of stuff that really happened to us back in the day. And lo and behold, critically acclaimed or not, all the awards or not, how ratings or not, like that muff. I can't even tell you how many places I went where I heard all different races of people talking about that fucking show when it was on it was a f- hit yeah, and they when, literally can- canceled the shit yeah when they make sense what they, this, they like no 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 that's wild as hell to me like to no. be successful and uh-uh. still it doesn't matter because when, they don't like the story that you tell them oh yeah when the execs went back and saw that and they looked at that and they saw so uh Niggers being <laughs> <laughs> niggers being gods, not over here, not not, not in this fucking situation. not on our watch. No, not, not no way. God damn it! For real, <laughs> they're like we're not inspiring none of those nigglets. <laughs> Duncan, you- get Duncan, get this off the air immediately. <laughs> I can't believe you guys tried to slip that past us, you old wild fucks. Uh, look and at that. That was slick with that one, with the you, special effects. <laughs> so what you did, niggers. You're a funny nigger with that one. <laughs> funny What's nigger with, with that, that one. <laughs> funny nigger. Imagine that. Niggers oh, being inspired oh. to be... <laughs> uh, like, we would let that happen. You guys did that one. That was just so fucking perfect. Yeah, so they weren't letting that shit. They weren't gonna let that shit ride. Nah, nah, unfortunately. But that show was so good. I was like fiending for each week. It was like, when is it Sunday? Is it Sunday? I need to see the next episode, please. Is it on? It's yeah. on. It's on. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah, they they uh that Black Panther. I'm not. I I saw it and I saw it like okay. three times. So when I saw oh, it, oh wow. The- I mean, I have the AMC rewards card, so like it the don't, same, it, right? Mm-hmm. You know, it don't matter how many times I go and see it, but I sat Pers- there the, the first time and I was looking at it and I was just going, "Okay, cool." Uh, everybody's in here being emotional because that's what they're doing. This movie is to, to play on your, your emotions and get you involved in it, but you you <laughs> neglect the other people I was watching. I was like, "Yo, they're neglecting everything else that's going on in this movie." They're neglecting it. So the second time I went to see, I was like, all right, now I'm just going to start watching everything that's happening around. And you notice all this shit, man. And you're looking at it and you're going, oh my God, like they're not letting us succeed on no level. Mm. Like the whole thing is the whole thing. The whole narrative. Yes. Kill the king and, and, and then the women will be in charge and the women are weak. That's what they show. Bro, this That's is what they show. The Woman King. This is only a few weeks after Woman King came out. Bang bang. Which, which I did see that because um, my my home girl wanted to see it. I was when I was like, sure. I think uh, back Black Panther was out at the same time, and I still like perspective. You, I also have the AMZ thing, and I still didn't see Black Panther. That's how trash I am about it. I I could have seen it on my free thing multiple times i walk across the street from movie theater my, my, my i dream. just do not want to see it i'm not i ugh, i didn't want to send the theater for that one my i dream. saw so many movies while they I was murdered out too they murdered the king invaded the empire 
killed the queen. The daughter goes missing or whatever. She gets kidnapped or whatever. And like everybody can just run rampant through the kingdom now. That's what y'all doing. Right? And then when he, and then so the when they go military get her, was like, nah. <laughs> they just like, okay, we're gonna send one person to go find her. And then that person goes find her, brings her back. She has a chance to kill a motherfucker that had invaded and done all this wicked shit to them. And she says to him, yield. So that's what you basically sending a message at about us is that we can be cruel to ourselves, to one another, but we cannot kill our enemy. Okay, mm, I got you. That's deep. That's I deep. hear you. Oh, no. Well, but, that, but that's man. real life. That's real life. Oh, yeah. I know. I don't know. It's always been like that. It's just that's like... Almost, it's, that's a damn and, 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 always been pushing. I, and it's fitting that today is MLK Day because that's the narrative that is his narrative basically yeah. in a lot Part of ways of the cheek and shit. right you know so yeah that's interesting i don't want the whole movie i'm gonna go see i'm gonna see it still i want i want to still be somewhat surprised during the movie and make it not be totally worthless of me watching it but right. <laughs> but um Barbara yeah i'm shit. not i'm not super i just been i just want to I see a new a new movie come up. I immediately IMDb the shit. I start going through the whole mm -hmm. process, especially right. if I find myself, you know, vaguely interested in it. Certain mm -hmm. certain concepts automatically, you know, turn me off anyway. So like the woman king would have never appealed to me. Ain't, I wouldn't even been like, oh Viola Davis and this shit, shit, it's gonna be a hit. No, I'm just saying like that. You know what I'm saying? But with the Black Panther, I was disappointed because immediately right out the gate, I start finding out little things about the story that didn't add up to me, and I was really looking forward to that movie. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Hey, a the the first scene it it caught me, you know the whole emotion of uh of the king being dead, you know, and them trying to uh get get the preparations for him, his funeral and all that, right? And mm -hmm. you you get you get a little I, me I got a little emotional. I remember my mom's that has passed and all this, so you know mm -hmm. I get a little emotional. And then after the after they do the funeral, they zoom his body off into wherever it goes because we don't know where they take the body. All right. I looked at the screen. I went wait. There wasn't one motherfucking Avenger at his funeral. Interesting. But anyway, you know, now I you know what's now I've already heard that. That's